trainers. Today I'm going to talk to you about the new sign-in sheet that has been designed for you to use during your income acceleration demo events. I'd like to talk to you a little bit about the purpose behind the sheet. Uh, there's two purposes in having a sign-in sheet. First of all is to collect people's contact information. So you'll see here there's a place for them to put the date as well as their contact information and I have uh, complete contact information so um, that you've got ways to connect with them phone, email, um, with a direct mail piece like a greeting card or something such as that. Uh, also information here for you to find out what business they're in that may help you to be able to know how you can assist them if you know, you know whether they're in Mary Kay or Arbonne or maybe they're just a realtor um, that knows, helps you to know best how you can serve them. And then uh, finally over here, you'll see that there is uh, some options here for them to circle. And there's a little legend here up at the top. And I'm going to go through the legend with you. And that way you'll understand better how to use this sheet. But as I mentioned, the purpose of the sheet is simply to collect people's contact information. And then finally, to assess what their interest is. That's it. Uh, this is not meant to be a sales tool, you know, necessarily. It's not meant to, for you to, you know, close them on something to purchase at the moment. It's simply to give you an idea of where their interest is so that you know how to assist them and move them forward to uh, what it is that's going to help them the most. All right. So next, um, I'm going to go through the, the four options here on the sign-in sheet at the top um, so you understand what that is. Option A says... I'd like to become an official member of um, whatever you call your group. So many of our trainers call their groups the Income Acceleration Network of Arizona or the Residual Income Players Group of Denver. Um, so whatever you decide to, to call your, your group, um, if somebody circles option A, that allows them to become an official member, you're going to be following up with them, sending them emails about events that you do, uh, staying in touch with them, and so they're basically going to be part of your email list. Okay. Um, B says, I'd like to be registered for Skill Radio, the free weekly skill training call with residual income game inventor Clay Stevens. And so what this does when they circle B, this actually gives you permission to go and register them for Skill Radio. If they circle B, you're going to want to let them know that they will be receiving, re, be receiving a confirmation email. And then they'll be notified of when the call is and how to access that call every week. And what's really valuable about this is that when somebody does register or you register someone for Skill Radio, this enters them into our sales funnel, so to speak. So when they've been a, a participant in Skill Radio, they'll receive a call from our customer service department who will follow up with them, ask them how they're enjoying Skill Radio, um, you know, what difference it's making in their business and in their life, and then that customer service uh, rep will start to ask them about, you know, what they're looking to accomplish and and from there move them ideally to transacting on a PE profile or a skill mastery system or skill mastery system with coaching and so you basically have a sales force working behind the scenes for you helping you to um, create those transactions which then will put checks in your pocket so uh, you definitely want to be getting people's permission and, and having people register for skill radio and putting them in that sales funnel option C says I'd like more information about the personal effectiveness profile assessment to find out my own personal effectiveness and how I can improve it. So what this does is this just lets you know if they're interested in learning more about the PE profile. And if they are, then you then have the opportunity to invite them to a webinar where they can learn more about the PE profile. It's a very powerful um, informational a webinar where they can see before and afters of the profile and start to see um, you know why it would be really important for them to find out exactly what their personal effectiveness is and take that um, and so that webinar is designed to move the person to take action so when somebody circles C then you would invite them to attend the webinar uh, 
Um, if you have reached a certain level of trainer advancement, uh, your PIPs are at a certain level, you will have the opportunity to use that PowerPoint yourself. So you can do your own webinars or do live um, you know, demonstrations using that PowerPoint presentation. Um, so that's C. And then finally, option D says, I am interested in having you facilitate an event for my team or my organization. And so if they circle D, then that lets you know that they want you to come in and do a private event for them. And that's going to obviously expand your database now because they're going to put people in front of you. And those people are then uh, you know, gonna, uh, um, going to either transact immediately when they come to one of your events or down the road. And in addition, when you do a private event, you have the opportunity to charge for that event. And our trainers are charging anywhere from $5 a person to $75 a person for a private event. And you get to take that money and put it in your pocket and keep it. So uh, doing private events can be very profitable for you as well. So those are the four options um, and uh, the things that they're going to have the opportunity to circle when they uh, get this sign-in sheet. Now, what's important about the sign-in sheet, most of the time when we go to an event, we sign in at the beginning. And this sign-in sheet is designed a little bit differently because if somebody's coming for the first time, they're not going to know what any of this means. And it's going to be like talking a foreign language to them. So what I recommend is that you send the sign-up sheet around about two-thirds to three-fourths of the way through your demo event. At that point, people will have a better understanding of skills and peps, and um, they'll have had an opportunity to play the game, so they're going to see the power in it. And so then the circling these options is going to make a lot more sense. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take the opportunity to demonstrate for you how I present this sign-up sheet during an event so that you can start to um, practice uh, the way that I teach you or model for you. So, all right. All right. I love practice. Yeah. Woo, right. that was... Hi, can I just have your attention for a moment? Uh, I want to give you an opportunity to sign in our sign-in sheet. And um, there's a place here for you to put all your contact information. And then you'll notice over here on this side of the sign-in sheet that there is some letters for you to circle. And I just want to help you understand what those letters mean. Um, if you circle A, that means that you'd like to become an official member of the Income Acceleration Network. And by that, you'll be getting notices of our future uh, events, um, any workshops that we have, any one-day trainings, um, more of these Income Acceleration demo events. So if you'd like to be on that mailing list, go ahead and circle A. B says um, that you'd like to be registered for Skill Radio, which is a free weekly training call by Clay Stevens, who's the creator of the residual income game itself. And so if you circle that, uh, you'll be receiving an email confirmation, and you'll have access to that free weekly training call. An extremely powerful call. Um, C says that you'd like more information about the personal effectiveness profile assessment and being able to find out what your own PEP score is. So you understand on the game when we're talking about PEPs and you've seen your PEPs increase as we've played, well, you can find out what your PEPs are in real life. And so if you're interested in learning more about that, go ahead and circle C. And then finally, if you're interested in having me come and facilitate an event like this for your team or your organization, then go ahead and circle D. So I'm going to go ahead and give you this, and you can um, fill it out, and then once you're done, I'll come back and get it. And All right. you can just keep playing from there. Thanks.